Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna show you how I made this amazing baseball cake. I first started off with this ball cake pan and filled it a little over a quarter of the way full with cake batter. I then made what I call a well with buttercream just to hold all my filling in. I went around a couple times with my buttercream because I wanted a thicker filling in the middle of my cake. I'm now filling my cake with cream cheese icing. I feel it pairs very well with red velvet cake. Then to finish up with part one. Now for part two, I'm gonna be rolling out this white fondant to cover my cake with. I had a few air bubbles that I poked out with a small needle. I had my cake in the freezer so I sprayed it with a little bit of water so that the fondant would stick to the cake. You're going to want to pull the bottom of your fondant out with one hand while smoothing the rest of your fondant at the top out with your other hand. This will prevent your fondant from creasing at the bottom. I'm just using my fondant smoother now to smooth out my cake into a perfectly round ball. I printed out a template of the stitching of a baseball and I'm just outlining it so that I know where to start my stitching. I have this red fondant now that I'm going to be rolling into a thin strip.
Now I'm marking off inch pieces of the strip just to make detailed stitching on the baseball. I'm now taking each little stitch and I'm forming a triangle shape out of each one, making sure to point the ends of each piece. I made two small indents right where the ends of my stitching would fit in, just like you would see on an actual baseball. I use a paintbrush and a little water to stick the stitching onto my cake. I then repeated the process on the other side. I'm going to be airbrushing my cake with a little bit of brown food coloring now just to give it a look of a dirty baseball. I'm just going to finish up my cake board here with the matching red ribbon. Now that that's done, I'm using this green buttercream with this grass tip attached to my piping bag. And I'm just making patches of grass all around my cake board. And that's it. As always, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more videos like this.